All right, you know, we've hear, heard the one game at a time, one game at a time. There's only one game left. It's going to be for the state championship. Uh, coach, just talk about the game out there today against a tough federal team. Uh, yeah, our kids kids played well. They executed the plan that those coaches had for them, and, and uh, you know it was it's amazing you can keep that many good great athletes that they had out of the end zone, and, and we did a you know great job defensively, and obviously scored enough had enough chances to score points, and uh, that's a good recipe. The expectations placed on this team at the beginning of the year, knowing that it had you know it was a state caliber group. But to actually get that done, how, how rewarding is that to have your confidence well, I think, at least that I, I think those kids put a lot of expectations on themselves because as hard as they worked in the off season, and, and so they, you know, they had a they had a plan and a goal, and, and you know, we didn't have to put them along too long, too hard, and, and they they had a plan. Uh, Ninety eight, two thousand and three. You've been there. You had the experience. Uh, what are some things that you need to do this week to get the team mentally prepared to play in, in the biggest game of their lives? Well, we, we started running inside last week because uh, it's cold outside. And, and we've always done that in the past. And, and people forget how really it's hard to get here. It is hard to get here. Uh, it takes a lot of work and uh, a, lot of, a lot of coaches' time, a lot of kids' time. And, and uh, now hopefully we can just enjoy it here for... 24 hours or so, and then get ready to play the next team. Um, the job that you, Coach Ho, Coach Somerville, the defensive staff did really this whole year, but especially today against a, a tough team that was expected to put up a lot of points. Um, what does that say about just the job that you guys have done and then offensive you know, coaches as well, just the, the hours and the film and all that? Uh, just talk about that a little bit. Well, it's like you said, they, they watch a ton of film. Those kids watch a ton of film. and. Uh, you know, the job those guys did today it was outstanding. It all stems from being, you know, having the ball run on you the last game you played last year for 600 yards. That kind of stuck in everybody's craw. And so we went to work on what are we going to do to keep the, you know, keep people from running the football on us. And, and like I've said in the past, Coach Hogan, those guys did a great job. And uh, we give up a pass every now and then, but we can live with that. Uh, either Camus or Bellarmine Prep. I'm sure you're gonna watch that game tonight. Do you know anything about either of those teams? I know Camus is supposed to be really good. Well, Bellarmine Prep has the same kind of uniform we do. I know that. Camus has uh, been, you know, killing everybody. They've only had one game that they hadn't had a running clock, so they'll be, hey, you know, you just gotta go play now and uh, see what happens. All right, Coach. Well, that one game, that final game, it's here. It's upon us. Good luck uh, to you in that game. Congratulations on making it that far. Thank you.